this time we're gonna create our own custom LV searches for uh, Surf Raw. So last time we talked about this program, we just type in SR LV, and it shows us all your um, what is it LVs that you can actually search from. Like so, basically these are search engines. Okay, so you have like YouTube, Yahoo, Wikipedia, and all that. And when you want to search for something, like let's say Wikipedia, and I don't know, we search for um, torrent or something right and it opens it to that page with your default web browser right um, if we want to create our own because you know this one is only some of the popular ones let's say there's a website that is not on here and you want to create your own so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna create our own LV and we're gonna use it with surf raw okay so for our example here we're gonna use this um, was a website called manda.org basically it's uh, a website to search man pages um, they do have old versions and all that too and for different distributions so if you search for let's say um, wget here right it gives you all the results of whatever package uh, that has a man page with the wget in it so you can see that if I click on wget now I can get the man page for it right um, but when you search, let me see if you actually see this link here. Let me copy and make it bigger. So Leafpad. So when you're searching on that website, um, the only thing that actually changes is this wget uh, keyword here, right? Everything else, you know, in front of it or whatever, it's not going to change. It's static. It stays the same. The only thing that does changes is this wget or whatever other keyword, you know, you want to type in right so that's what we're going to use uh, for our LVs and to do this we're going to use an existing one because that's simpler okay so what we're going to do is uh, we're going to use this YouTube one here as our template and uh, we're just going to edit it out so to do this if you're on like a Debian or Ubuntu system you can always type in um, dpk G dash L and we're gonna type in surf raw and basically this will tell us like you know where is that located at so we're gonna go up up and where is it out here just say YouTube there you go so this is the location USR libs and surf raw and then YouTube so we're just gonna copy that here you can confirm it by cutting it out if you want All right and this is basically the code and what we want to do is uh, put in our own custom one. So let me give you an example here. Go to CD, conf, surf raw. All right. If you don't have this folder, let me delete that. How about that? We'll delete the folder. All right. So let's say if you don't have the LV folder, all you got to do is mkdir LV, and you created one. And CD into it. This is basically where you put in your custom searches. Um, so that's what we're going to do. Okay. And so what we're going to do in here is we're going to copy our existing YouTube one and we're going to rename it to what's that? Manded. Right. And that's all you got to do. Now we have our Manded um, search like there. Now, if it's not already, was that executable? You want to, you know, chmod plus exit and then manded. Uh, but it's already executable, just give you an example there. Anyways, we're going to open it with our text editor. I'm going to use Vim for this, all right? But basically, in here, let me make it bigger here. This is the whole code. It's, you know, all you got to do is change out, you know, the links. Uh, some of the names of it and stuff like that. So that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna change all the YouTube ones to Manda.org. So let me do that here. So I'm gonna type YouTube.com. Right. So all the YouTube.coms we're gonna change it to what was that? Uh, Manda.org, I believe. .org. Right, we just changed all of that, and also some of these other ones like YouTube, YouTube, and YouTube, whatever. So that's what we're gonna do, and 
Or is that here? YouTube. What do case sensitive for this? Alright, and we're going to change that to. Hmm, what is that one? Uh, man did. And we'll call this man page. So, just to be more clear. And that's it. Alright. And other stuff. Okay, they have this other one called YouTube here. So, we're going to replace that one also. YouTube. And I think that's the last one here. So, we're going to create. Oops, I did the wrong one. There we go. So, let's change this to man did. And I think that should be it for that. Anyways, that's all you got to change in there. Just the name, stuff like that. If you want to change, like, uh, I don't know, the author. Because now you created it. So, we'll just say my name here. And what's today's date? Today it's the 17. So, all this necessary? Not really. You can just skip some of this if you wanted to. But that's what we're going to do. And... Right now it's 2012, and it's on. Is it? Yeah, it's Saturday also. Uh, so the part down here, like I said before, this is the important part. Okay. Um, basically is what we did before. So when you search for something, this part right here is static. The only part that changes is the keyword, which what we used earlier was the W get right. So that's what we're gonna do down here. You see here. Uh, we're gonna change it. To, was that? Um, uh, yeah, we're gonna see CT dollar sign. There you go. And we're just gonna paste that part in here. This thing is basically, you know, keyword. It's the same shit, all right. And whenever you type something in, it's gonna go to that page, and it's gonna look for that uh, word that you're looking for. So that's all we're going to do is save it now. And now we have just the mandate. So if we run this, SR uh, LV, right? They should have a, it says uh, the bottom here, it says local LV. And we have our mandate here. And it says search mandate man page uh, from, what was that, mandate.org here. So if you want to run this, SR mandate. And you search whatever you want. Let's say uh, we search for wget, and it should open it uh, this page here, right? So if you search for something else, let's say uh, tmux, and it should open it. Now, if it only has one result, it goes directly to that man page. Uh, if it has like multiple results, like we had before, then it's gonna give you this list. But uh, usually, I don't use a uh, web browser. Uh, I mean, a GUI web browser for this. So I'd probably say recommend you use, um, what is that, a command line web browser. So to do that, let's go back here. And it should have your configurations here. So vim into conf. And in here, you type in whatever your, um, you know, your command line web browser is. I'm going to use W3M. And we're going to save that. And now, whenever I do sr mandate and tmux it's going to go directly to that page and you can see I can look at it uh, you know the man page from here if I want to search a new one I can go enter here and let's say search for I don't know vim all right oops enter enter and there you go this is vim there's a lot of vims in here so I can just tab it hit enter and here's the one for vim Anyways, that's how you create your own uh, custom LV searches uh, with SurfRaw, and it should load it if you have it executable and everything is correct and everything like that. Anyways, that's it for this one. Uh, that's all.